Hey guys, Corey here from Sky's the Limit Car Care, and today we've got a very special guest, Lars from Colorlock. We're going to be talking about, in this video, the Colorlock Top Life Coating for leather, and we're gonna go over a, a variety of things. Lars is gonna tell us how to apply it, um, how it compares to uh, traditional coatings or le traditional leather coatings that are on the market, how long it lasts, and ways to maintain it, as well as any tips and tricks that you might wanna know. So stick around to enjoy more. All right, guys, so first I want to tell you a little bit about Lars, uh, and then we'll get right into uh, Top Life Coating. So Lars has had uh, been working with leather since he was 17 years old, going on three decades of experience. Um, he's a good friend of mine, and he's taught me a lot about leather care over the past year that I've gotten to know him. Um, I'm really excited to see what he's going to talk about uh, today with Top Life, and I think you guys are going to enjoy it too. Thank you so much for coming, Lars. Yeah, thank you so much for having me. Thank you for the nice words. Also, that the people know how old I'm now, but <laughs> <laughs> that is uh, a case. Who have yeah. So, uh, so what is top life coating? So, top life coating is something what what we what we create because a lot of people are asking for something what is longer lasts than our leather shield. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And um, what is not um, like a ceramic coating, who maybe is not the best way to protect your leather. Sure. So, we create a product, what is like a coating, but in the end it's a sealant because you can remove it with the prepare what is here inside. So Excellent. It's, so it's yeah. easy to remove if it's needed, right? Yeah. And um, other topics is um, it's solvent free. So when you apply, you don't damage the original finish. Thing, what right. you do with a solvent product because leather is not solvent resist. Right. right? Yeah. Um, then it's breathable. So what means it still can keep moisture and give moisture back when you sit on it and you sweat, you know, so right. if, if, you, if you don't have this and the leather doesn't dry out because it is breathable and it is still carable, what means when you put a conditioner on it, it can pass the top life layer and also the finishing layer and go through to the leather. Yeah, yeah? that makes perfect sense. Yeah. The touch is soft, it's similar or it's, it's like so we have now a real leather touch here. When we apply this later, then you will feel the same. You have the same feeling. Yeah. It's gloss level is nice. It's more matte than glossy. That's right. What people not want shiny and greasy it's looking. Not yeah. Shiny and greasy. <laughs> yeah. And um, yeah, it keeps your leather um, for around about twelve months clean, but not means you don't have to clean it. Right. <laughs> but. If it comes dirty or if you get some jeans dye transfer or something like this, mm -hmm. you just can clean it with a mild leather cleaner and a sponge. Right. So it's very easy. Just wipe off the dirt and that's it. Okay, so Lars, how does Top Life compare to traditional leather coatings? Yeah, so the, the first thing is water-based. So when you apply, you don't damage the surface because Perfect. the traditional one is solvent-based. Right. right. Mm -hmm. It's also safer to, to use it and better for for stocking and all of this mm -hmm. thing, shipping, blah, yes. blah, blah, so. Yeah, we so have all kinds of trouble with the, you know, hazmat and all these things we have to worry about. So it's really nice yeah. to not have to worry about that with any of your products. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. correct. Um, then it's breathable. Mm -hmm. no? I know some doing this too now, but this is from the beginning breathable. Um, very nice touch, original touch. It doesn't mm -hmm. change the touch. It's flexible, doesn't crack or something like this on, on a long term. And, um, it's um, re um, removable, correct? Right, yeah. yes, the most importantly, <laughs> yes. <laughs> so that's why we, 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 we call it coating, but it is more a sealant product. No? It's long last, right. uh, 12 months, but um, it is removable with a, with a prepare inside. Not with so, a strong leather cleaner, not with a mild leather cleaner or another leather cleaner from another brand, um, but with a prepare, what it comes with a kit, what you need to prepare the surface before you you, you apply the, the top coat, um, uh, the top life coating, um, you can remove this with a prepare. Perfect. So it's easily removed without having to polish it, which obviously you can't polish the leather. So that's great. Yeah. Excellent. And how is it with, as far as UV protection? Does it have a lot of UV protection on its own or do we need to top it with one of our other products or? No, there's no UV protection inside. Mm -hmm. And honestly, a, a pigmented leather who is um, in, a, in a correct condition or in a good condition don't need it because pigments don't fade it. Pigments, mm -hmm. they're rubbing off, 
from when you come in and out of a car. Ah, yeah. I see. Yeah. So, but die will feel it. So if you if you have a um, if you have an aniline, like a repaired area yeah. or oh, no, an aniline leather. Yeah, when yeah, you have yeah. an aniline leather, so the King Range interior, for example, mm -hmm. what is an aniline? Um, this will this will fade it by sun. This yeah. type of leather needs a new UV filter for sure. But uh, a pigmented leather, um, in the f so when it's when it's new and in good condition, it doesn't really need a UV filter. That's why we have the protector. We have a UV filter, right? Mm -hmm. What is our conditioner? Right. But this is for old leather. What is a little bit older, so the clear coat is maybe gone, and mm -hmm. then it needs the protection. So with Top Life, what's the longevity? How long can people expect it to last on their leather? Obviously, it depends on you know how yeah, the conditions. Uber driver maybe less. Yeah. Than, um, <laughs> than somebody who just drive a short way to his home, sure. but we, 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 we promised 12 months and mm -hmm. this is um, easy to, to cover. Yeah. Excellent. That's great. That's really good durability for something that's safe for the leather. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. So who's the product for? Like, who would you see as, you, as the primary uh, customer that would want Top Life or benefit from Top yeah, Life? Yeah, so the, the primary customer is a customer with a brand new car mm -hmm. with a very bright light interior. Ah, okay. Yeah. So, and one thing maybe... Um, interesting very often you have leather here and vinyl there mm -hmm. you don't have to care for this you can apply also this product on vinyl ah okay that's great yeah. to know excellent all right so we've learned a lot about top life today um, we actually carry the top life pro coating as well which you know yeah. um, so what would you see as the uh, as the differences between the two so our viewers can learn more about yeah. that as well so the, the the pro what the name already say is for professionals mm -hmm. um, we recommend to take also a training that they get a better understanding. Um, it's not hard to apply, but we want to give the people a little bit more background information. The difference is that we can um, uh, we have a longer last, so 24 months, because there's a hardener you add to this. It doesn't make it dangerous, but um, there's a, um, a certain time you have to use this product, yeah. and we recommend also to spray this product and then yeah, we, we do in this training a little bit more safety information, wearing a mask and something like this. And this is just easy to use. This Everybody can do this. My grandma is yes. okay yeah. with this. Excellent. You know? Yeah. Yeah, that's a great explanation. Thank you so much. Um, today, we're going to actually be doing a demonstration on the DIY version, this Top Life uh, coat that you have in front of you. And I think later we're going to also do a demonstration for the professional version as well, correct? Yes. Excellent. Okay. So Corey, what I mentioned before is um, that I say it's primary for a brand new car. Um, obviously, we don't have a brand new seat here. <laughs> <laughs> um, that is not that we don't get a brand new seat, but uh, you can use it also on a used car. So, and in this case, of course, it's very important uh, to clean it before. Even if it's a brand new car, we, we normally recommend to clean um, to to clean the leather to be make uh, make sure that it's clean because we we will um apply so the, the top life coating is like a like a top coat or a clear you know and um we want to when you when you do a paint job you you also degrease and take care for a, for a clean surface so that it makes sense to clean the surface also before just with a mild leather cleaner with a brush or with a sponge however you, you, you like it more and then um, we have the top life uh, kit and in this kit it comes with a top life prepare yeah that's for the prep what right the name is already saying for this we have the gloss and um, the coating himself um, we apply it with a sponge perfect okay so we will start with the with the prep and the prep is also this product what can remove the top life if it has to remove. Um, maybe there's a there's a you, you get a scratch in the leather and you have to repair it, right? Yeah. Then you have to remove the prepare uh, the the top life coating because um, you want a proper bounding with your color. Ah, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. So that's why we make it um, removable. Yeah. And then just wipe it and be sure that you get any angle so i recommend to do um how you call it in english a cross, cross wiping. Mm -hmm. yeah so and that's so, to get in the grains yeah and mm -hmm. also that you that you don't miss any ah. any place mm -hmm. yeah the prepare what the prepare is doing is um it opens the original 
surface a little bit, mm. make it make it welcome or make it prepared to right. take a coating on yes. it. Yes. So you wipe it over and then it has to be dry. So I will use now a heat gun. Normally you don't need a heat gun because or a hair dryer because when you start on the driver's seat, going to the passenger seat, going to the back seats, when you come back to the driver's seat, the driver's seat is dry. Right. right? So if you're not using a heat gun, then it's 20, 30 minutes is dry. Even yeah, less. Even, yeah, yeah. Even less, even less. Okay. Okay. Then the top life coating. And so you have it with many, many chemicals. You have to shake it before you use it. Okay. So make sure that you really shake it well. Then we have this applicator block or sponge, and then we put a little bit here on the surface, and then everybody who see videos with application a coating or is doing coatings, yes, knows this is more or less the same, it's the same way. And a very thin layer is enough, and um, one layer is absolutely enough. So only thing is we do again this. Uh, we applicate in a cross mm -hmm. and I recommend to applicate it um, on piece seam uh, to seam seam to seam mm -hmm. yeah exactly okay one of these let it dry or use a heat gun and that's it Excellent. That was really uh, great to see in person watching the master do it. I uh, really appreciate you showing us the demonstration. Uh, I, I am curious, you mentioned that we only have to do one coat, which yes. I think is terrific. It's great to be able to save time. Time is money for all the professionals and everybody that's doing it as a hobby. Maybe they would like to be working on other parts of their car as well. So that's great. But I have for sure customers that are going to ask me, can I put two coats on? Um, what will happen if I do two coats? And is that just a time of a uh, waste of time and money, or will I get a benefit from that? No, it's waste waste of time. So you don't get any benefit from this. You you maybe get risks that you get a gray shadow on it, but it's too thick. So the the product is really designed to have a thin coating. That um, yeah, the the touch is nice. The breathable yeah. effect is there. That. I mean, in the end, you don't want to see that you add something on it, right? Exactly right. Yeah. Yeah, and, um, yeah, and it looks great with one coat, you... and it feels so nice already. Yeah. Yeah, it's very nice. Yeah, that's what, what a lot of people really appreciate, really like, the, the touch after yeah. when you put it on. It feels really natural, soft, yeah. nice, and right? Yes, unlike paint. There's no reason to touch the paint, but the leather, you're touching no matter what. So it's yeah. nice to have that feeling yeah, when you get absolutely. in and out of the car and your hands go across it. It's a, a very good feeling. Yeah. That's terrific. Yeah, and it's quick and easy, huh? It, very easy, yes. Everybody can do this. Absolutely. Even your grandmother. <laughs> yeah, even my grandmother. Yeah. yeah, perfect. All right. Well, thank you so much, Lars. This is a really great, uh, I think this video will help a lot of our customers. I really appreciate you being here and uh, thanks again. Yeah, uh, thank you for having me. Thank Absolutely. you for watching this. Any question, come to us. Yeah, thank you guys so much for, uh, for joining us again. If you have any questions or comments, like Lars said, leave them below um, or reach out. We'll be happy to take care of you anytime. And uh, we look forward to seeing you next time.